We have developed this platform in partnership with the Airport Research Centre and in, in partnership with Airbus Space and Defence. And the idea is it's a platform which is a total airport simulator. It's covering all of the processes that you typically find in an airport. So it's covering the aircraft themselves, it's covering the turnaround processes, but importantly it's also covering the passenger process. So it has a full model of the way passengers move through the terminal, the way aircraft arrive at the airport, the taxi in process, the turnaround, and the deboarding and the boarding of passengers. So it's a fully integrated uh, total airport model. For us, the key um, is flexibility. We wanted flexibility in terms of the, number, the type of scenarios that we can play. So, for example, in one single day, we can look at a scenario covering adverse weather conditions, looking at problems within the terminal, looking at runway uh, capacity problems. So all of the typical problems and scenarios that you find in an airport, we can, we can rapidly look at those in, in a totally flexible uh, manner. The second um, notion of flexibility is in the platform itself. We wanted to have something that we refer to as a rapid prototyping platform. So what that means is we can rapidly reconfigure um, the, the, the platform itself, remodel different requirements in a short space of time. So overall, we find the quality of what we ultimately provide to industry uh, for deployment. And we're starting to use this model um, in our validation activities. We've fully implemented um, the requirements coming from uh, CESAR in the context of airport operations management. And what we do in our gaming is we invite different airport stakeholders to actually play a number of different scenarios using this platform. So typically we'll have airlines participating, we have the airport operator, we can have the air navigation service provider, the ground handlers. So the full spectrum of, of participants from an airport can come and actually use this simulator. Each user of the simulator, each airport stakeholder, has an environment which is catered to their own information requirements. So it's a fully configurable uh, environment and each stakeholder can uh, configure the environment to show the information that they specifically need at a given point in time. But also they interact with the simulator so they can make inputs into the simulation as a function of their own operational um, needs and requirements. And then the simulator takes into account those inputs and reacts accordingly. So it's a fully functional total airport simulator that evolves as a function of what the stakeholders uh, are doing.